Hi, I'm Underbelly, and you suck at producing. Have you ever had the pleasure of feeling the warmth of another human's body as you drift off into sweet slumber with the knowledge that everything's going to be okay? Well, neither have I. That's why in today's lesson, we're going to learn how to turn a cold, unforgiving beat into a soft, warm one. Let's get started. Okay, we got our booty beat right here. Let's take a listen. Mm -hmm. Swag. Okay, so that's pretty swag, and you got Clarence on the keys and Derek the drums, but here's the thing, it sounds just a little cold and uninviting. So let's go ahead and start with Derek. Um, so Derek and I haven't really been getting along ever since I moved in with his mother. He's always been a little cold to me, so why don't we go ahead and teach him a lesson by gluing all his limbs together so he doesn't thrash around so much. And the way we're gonna do that is we're gonna use a glue compressor and we're gonna use the drum full parallel preset. And if you guys aren't familiar, parallel compression, all it is is we're just mixing a super compressed glued together version of Derek, which I prefer because he can't thrash around so much. And also uh, the perfect uncompressed version of Derek, which his mother is familiar with and prefers. And uh, the reason why we mix both together is so that um, Derek can't thrash around so much, but also his mother doesn't suspect a thing. But for now, she's away at work. So let's go ahead and glue Derek's limbs together. So he's totally immobile. And let's just hear how that sounds real quick. Okay, so as you can see, uh, when we played that, we're seeing a lot of gain reduction happening. That's what's that's what you're seeing when this uh, needle jumps up and down. The compressor is reacting to Derek's thrashings and dampening down upon them, but it's a little extreme right now. So why don't we go ahead and raise that threshold a little less. And as you can see, uh, since we're dampening down on him less, the overall effect is that he's louder and less restrained. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna compensate for that by putting a utility on there. Now he's the same volume as he was before. And as you notice, um, we're actually hearing a little bit of soft clipping. Uh, and let me just show you what I mean. Let's turn up the makeup here. Oh, it's just that nice little crunch. Let's just hear it without the soft clipping real quick. Just, you know, just get an idea. Much worse, we want that crunch. We want to hear his limbs shatter. And so that's what we're using here. Mm -hmm. Very good. And let's go ahead and mix that super crunchy signal uh, with the uncompressed version of Derek because his mother's home and we want him to appear normal as if we didn't have a talk. Perfect. Let's raise the utility there. And okay, so me and Derek actually have a lot of awkward silences. I don't know how to interact with children. Um, and why don't we go ahead and try filling those with a little bit of white noise. And I think there's some right here in the sample. We just extend that snare. Let's hear how that sounds. Right, and so it would be great if we could just fill that, uh, fill all the empty silences with a little bit of that white noise so it's not quite as awkward. So we're just gonna loop that right here. Oh, beautiful. Okay, we never have to feel uncomfortable around each other, Derek, I promise. Wowzers. It's already so much warmer. Okay, so now that we've disciplined Derek, let's move on to Clarence. And he's, you know, he's the shy type. He's nerdy, uh, unsocial, so he's much easier to deal with. Um, he's only going to need a little bit of disciplining. So why don't we just go ahead and put that overdrive on there and 
let's just hear that sounds real quick. Okay, so that's just that's just way too much. You know, the clearance is very sensitive. So we're just gonna need a little bit of warmth there. Just give them a nice little hug. You know, nothing too drastic. Just five percent on that dry wet there. Uh, should be perfect. And let's just hear how that sounds real quick. Mm. Just a little bit of crunch there. And another thing I like to do is I like to pit children against one another to cover up for my faults. So the way we're going to do that is we're actually going to lay a compressor on Clarence and we're going to side chain from Derek's kick drum, okay? Um, that way, you know, every time Derek has a tantrum, it affects Clarence. I'm re just simply redirecting uh, Derek's aggression at his absentee father towards his siblings. So let's just go ahead and hear how that sounds. Um, just a little bit there. All right, beautiful. And we can actually hear that Clarence is ducking out of the way. Whenever Derek is having a fit, which is just perfect. We're already hearing a lot more warmth here. Beautiful. Okay, so check it. Let's say it's a chilly autumn evening. Derek, Clarence, and their mother are on the couch, all just enjoying a nice episode of The Big Bang Theory. And then I walk in with uh, some popcorn, and I just get, you know, these cold looks. And uh, I really don't like that. Um, and you know what really brings a suboptimal improvised familial situation together. A nice warm blanket. Um, blanket. And, you know, that could take the form of a wool blanket, uh, you know, a cotton blanket. But we're just going to try and blanket these sounds together uh, just to make it seem much more cohesive and, and uh, functional than it actually is. And, you know, usually this is done with some vinyl crackle, maybe some nice ambient nature noises, you know, whatever you'd like, just nice something soft and ambient. So let's go ahead and I like to use this little sample right here. So you're hearing the final crackle, you're hearing, you know, maybe some birds in the background, um, you know, just to give it up. Oh, we don't want that flute there, but let's go ahead and just drag that in there. Just hear that sounds. Wow. Gosh, that's just gorgeous. Wowzers. So you see how the blanket gives the impression that it's actually a cohesive functional family unit here. And it's very warm, very warm. Okay, so check it. Today we learn how to turn a cold, unforgiving beat into a soft, warm one in which we can take comfort. Remember to be gentle with the overdriving and the compressing. You don't want things to overheat. Well, I'm Underbelly. Peace out.